are doing great. I'm so excited to be back. If you're on my Instagram or my Facebook, you already know I was on vacation one week and then as soon as I got back off vacation, I got sick. I was sick all week. But I'm back to 100%. I'm so happy to be back and I thought the perfect video to come back with would be my favorites to share with you those, th those things that I have been loving around my home. And so I don't share this every month or anything like that but when I have those things that I think that could be helpful to you or that you might enjoy, I love sharing them with you. So let's not stall anymore. Let's jump right in and I hope you will enjoy. Okay friends, let's start with the home decor items I've been loving around my home. Many of you know we did a refresh of our back patio. If you have not seen that video, I'll link it in the description box below and also above. But I am loving this space. But we did an all neutral background, so what we needed is a rug that really would bring the room together. And I am totally in love with my Safavea rug here. It is so beautiful and it's that vibrant blue and every time I look out here now I just I'm, it makes me happy and the colors are just gorgeous and the great thing about this Safavea rug is that it really is durable it's an indoor and outdoor rug so you can use it in the interior of your home or the exterior and I love that about it because I know that it's going to last on my back patio and it feels so good when I'm sitting out here on my feet it's just very relaxing I have my sweet tea and it's just a lovely thing and the colors bring in the colors that I have in the space. It has that little slight neutral along with the big pop of the blue that goes great with my ottoman and my decor pillows and things like that. It just really is a great addition to this space and I have been loving it and I don't think the room would come together like it had if I did not have this rug in the space. It just really it just really brought everything together. I just love it so much. And so if you're interested, Safavea has a beautiful line of different furnishings and rugs and mine's is the Courtyard Collection. Here's all the information for you if this is something that you're interested in, but they have all kinds of different colors and styles, so definitely check it out. Which brings me to my next love, the thing that I have been loving around my home. And this is our kitchen and you all may know we just recently, a couple months ago, did a DIY renovation. My husband and I, we did it ourselves and here's the results. We've been loving it and it's been just going great. But you may notice a change if you've been with me and it's our table. I put the extension, uh, the kind of middle part into the table, the extender rather, into the table and then I added a settee. And you all know I used to have a settee in my kitchen before we did the renovations and we really were missing it and we wanted more kind of seating in our kitchen area and this settee provided it and it fits perfectly. Again, it's from Safavea. You guys know my chairs here are from Safavea. I had got those months ago. I purchased those uh, when we did the renovation. And so to have this kind of settee to go with it, everything feels so cozy and warm. And it's so fun having my coffee here in the morning. And here's all the information for you about this specific settee but they have a nice variety on their website and I'll link their website below but I love that it's that linen fabric so it keeps my kitchen light because you, know, you guys know I love a white kitchen and I like things to be kind of neutral and airy and so it's really durable but it just really brings in the look that I love and so I have been really happy with this and this has truly been one of my favorites in my home right now so every time I come to my kitchen in the morning it just puts a smile on my face to be able to walk past and see my beautiful rug and then see that so now let's move into home entertaining okay so if you're on my Instagram you know about this I had just purchased this this week and I fell in love with it I was in Tuesday morning walked past all of these little pieces and my heart just went oh I love it but then I went around the store I said no I'm not buying anything else for the home right now we had just got off vacation I have some home projects going on I said I don't need to do any shopping right now and then it just kept calling my name and calling my name and I had to get it because all I could think about is entertaining in the fall and entertaining for the holidays and how cute this would be you know to do a breakfast buffet I know it's a bar set but I bought pieces so that I could use it as serving wear and put a beautiful white napkin in one with some muffins and then use the crafts for different orange juice and apple juices if I wanted to do in for Christmas or anything a little bar set I have the different things to do that now some were asking was it rose gold or copper and so I want to show you up close here it kind of looks more rose gold to me because because here's a co copper piece that I had got last fall and as you can see they do go together but it is slightly these pieces are slightly lighter than your typical copper so it really can go either way but I love the elegance of it having that rose gold look and so I got these two here so the shakers here one small which was $4.99 and I think it's just so cute and adorable and I love them together so I just can't wait to use these uh, whenever I 
do some type of entertaining. And the larger one was $9.99, totally gorgeous. So I also got the two kind of uh, champagne or wine buckets here. But again, I'm going to use these not only for wine or champagne. I'm going to use these for kind of serving, you know, just to make a beautiful display. I think they were like $5.99. And then I got the larger bucket here, which is gorgeous. And I fell in love with this one. I just love the handles on the side. I think it's just it's so elegant. And here is the company here. I think it's Portofino. Um, if you want to look it up, if you don't see it in your Tuesday mornings and you want this. And this one ran, I want to say around $14.99 for this piece which I thought was great I also got the ice bucket which is so cute and it has the lid on it and as you can see this is I just purchased these so it great that it made it to this video but I want to say I can't remember the price on this one here I can't remember but I'll put it in the description box below and then it was $29.99 for the large one here so let's move on to things I've been loving in my kitchen Okay, so one thing I have been loving is my glass cleaner. It's a full circle glass cleaner. I think it's just so neat. I belong to ePantry where I order all my kind of cleaning supplies online. I'll link it below if you're interested, but it's so convenient because I don't have to think about ordering cleaning supplies. And this is one of the things that they had on their site, so I had them send me one and I was totally in love. I love that you can put it in the dishwasher to clean it on the top shelf. It has this beautiful wood handle that you can sit straight up so that when it goes to dry, it just sits straight up and dry. You can replace the top there, so that's really convenient. So when it gets old and worn out, you can just replace it. I just picked up another one, had them send me actually another one for my mom. I'm going to take that down to her the next time I see her. Now, another thing I have been loving is my stovetop espresso maker. You know, this is just so neat for those days that I want to kind of make my espresso quickly. And it's just me at home. And I don't want to kind of really go through the motions with my actual machine. And so I love this here. You basically just unscrew the bottom off of it. It's just, it's nice and petite and perfect for me, you know, because a lot of times it's just me in the morning. So it's perfect for me here. You then want to just fill it, fill up the bottom with water. And you don't want to go kind of above your percolation kind of um, nozzle there. Then you just put the spout back on top and then from that point I want to add my espresso and so it's so simple because I can just make enough that's going to be a perfect little pot for myself and so I like to fill it to the top because I like for mine to have that nice strong you know flavor in it and you don't want to pack it down but I just pack it down just slightly so that I can get the lid on neatly without it going everywhere you're going to simply put your lid back on top and we are ready to percolate. So then you put your stove on just medium high and you're gonna sit it there until you start hearing it percolate and then you can start looking at it. You don't want it to percolate all the way to the top to where it overspills, but like right here is perfect and take it off the stove to let it finish. And you have the perfect cup of espresso and it's quick, easy, and I have been loving this little gadget here in my kitchen. Another thing is these Curacao napkins I got on vacation because we went to Curacao for vacation. It's, Curacao is about 30 minutes outside of Venezuela and and it's near the Aruba area and so it just was so cute when I went in the little gift shop and saw these and because my back porch is blue and all my entertaining wear is like this blue that I use out on my back patio I thought for the summer it'd be cute to kind of use these napkins they're disposable you know when we can reminisce about our vacation so let's talk about personal. Now I have been loving this Essie nail polish. I wish I had it on so you could kind of see it on, but when I got off vacation, my nails were shot, so I had to get them redone. And I usually get gel nails, but this is not a gel polish, but it's that beautiful gold. I love the metallic feel of it, and it's just really a very neutral, actual. And you guys know I've been in gold world lately. I love everything gold. But this is just really a beautiful nail polish, and it's called Good As Gold. It's 941, and it's Essie, and this has been one of my favorites. Okay, so this next favorite is so special to me because on our vacation in Curacao, one of the couples actually lives there. And we went on vacation with three other couples that are dear friends of ours. We were all, we all met actually when we were all stationed over in the United Kingdom and we became instant family and just always kept in touch and it's been five years down the road now and we decided we all have to get together at least every two years and so we said let's meet in Curacao and Angela and Shamat they're one of the couples and they the ones that live over there and they laid out the red carpet basically I mean everything was so special when they picked us up in the from the airport they rented a van they gave each of the couples this bag here so we each had our own bag and then they took us to our uh, hotel now the thing about it was when we got into the van they were dressed as tour guides they had the hats they had the microphone they did it up and inside this bag were two beach towels one for me one for Mike and every couple got their own bag so she did one of these bags for each couple and she's so thoughtful everything was from Curacao 
we had these maracas here and we actually pulled these out and used these in the van as we were driving to the hotel because we were so excited to see each other and we were just all over the place it was just it was a party bus so this is so cute to have as a memory and i am going to treasure this so th i thought this was so special she also put this black cake in here it's a cake and it's called black cake and it's kind of popular in the area or from the area and so i'm excited to try this i have not eaten it yet but i want to you know find a special time for me and mike to kind of um, enjoy it and reminisce about our holiday so it was neat she also had a beverage for me and a beverage for mike he had she had a corona for him and had this attached with a pretty ribbon to the corona and he drank his of course and but now he has this uh bottle opener keychain that from the trip and then she put some Behringer wine in there for me and I didn't drink mine but I have it so I can drink it later but I thought it was so nice so when we went back to the hotel to get ready for dinner we had our little beverage she also gave us some of the local honey so I'm excited to taste this this is going to be really neat along with a postcard of Curacao at night so everything was Curacao based she had these labels made and she put this beautiful silk ribbon around the bag and inside the bag she put all of this material about the area maps and events and things that were going on so if we saw anything we wanted to do we could do it while we were here she just put a lot of thought in here a lot of effort in here they made our vacation spectacular I, I want to do a video on just everything they did for us if you want that let me know in the comments below because I'm I would love to share that it was just really beautiful and I'm thankful to them for that and so this was something that is really was one of my favorites Okay, and my last favorites have to do with organization, which has to do with my planner. And one thing I've been loving is my new recollections hole punch. It's for your personal planner. I got it from Michaels. They ran about $19, which, you know, can be a little pricey, but I used a 40% off coupon, so I got a good savings there. But you guys know I'm in my gold phase, and I love gold. So I thought it was so pretty, and it's very durable. I think this will last for years and years and years, and so I was excited about that. Also loving my new file effects, my gold file effects. I carried it on vacation. It was the perfect size and it's just really beautiful. And my husband made me a pen to go with it that I absolutely love. Many of you may not know, he has a business where he hand makes pens. He make, hand makes them all himself. He does a beautiful job. He does the different styles and he can do them in different colors, but they're just really beautiful, great quality pens. And I'll put his link below if you're interested. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing my favorites. I hope you all are doing great. If you're not subscribed, it, definitely I would love to have you. Don't leave without clicking that subscribe button and joining us on this beautiful journey. I hope you all have a wonderful weekend and this is Nikki saying goodbye.